What's going on guys? This is Bootramp playing Boom Beach. So this is gonna be a short video guys. Um there's so much hype around the new troop and I'm hyped as well. Um uh, I want to show you a operation attack made by Gary Boom. It was using the uh, new troop grenadier and it was just totally awesome. So let's jump over to the operation log and find Gary Boom. So where is Gary Boom? There we got Gary Boom. So it's like 32 Grenaders there, level 10, maxed up level. And before we jump over to the replay, I want to show you the stats of the new troop. So we got like health, health of the Grenader was like 760 and the unit size is 6. And the training cost 70,000 gold, that's really expensive. Training time is really long as well. Um, the movement speed is slow, the range is very long, I can confirm that. The damage per second is 192, that's insane, that's totally insane. So let's tap out and I'm going to be showing you guys the, um, the replay on the operation. So let's jump over back to the log and find Gary Boom. So this is the uh, 1110 operation or the task force points operation it's really high building health on the, the statues same with the building damage so he was, he was using the smoke screen at the start to protect some of his uh, grenades because there's a lot of cannons and boom cannons at the start there and you basically do not want to lose your troops at the start so it's flare he was flaring at the right the left corner there and look at the range guys look at the range of those troops totally insane um, the cannons cannot even hit the grenaders because uh, it's too far away. They're just actually tossing the grenades from far distance and taking down the cannons. It's totally cool, guys. Totally awesome. So, what's the problem with using these troops? From what I see, um, they actually have problems against shock launchers and rocket launchers. So, when you're actually facing a real player and you're using this kind of troop, you need to stick your eyes to the screen and pay attention to the rocket launcher and the shock launcher because if you stop the DPS from this kind of troops it's gonna be failed because uh, the damage the main damage is from this guys and if they get hit like one time they're gonna be dying so the less you got of this troops the less damage you're gonna do so um, yeah they have actually some negative sides but also positive sides for me, I would say this is the one of the new, the new super team on Boom Beach because they are just totally, totally insane. The long range is totally OP and the high damage is super cool as well. The health pool is decent. They can actually handle some sniper tower, what do you call it? They can handle some sniper tower damage before they go down. Same with the machine gun and flame thrower. But if a boom cannon or a cannon hits the new troop, they are just going down like a fly, guys. So this was attack. I wanted to show you guys because I think it was totally awesome. I don't think there's anyone else there. Um, I don't think there's any YouTubers out there that's shown that have shown an operation attack using the new troops. So, anyways, that's all for today. See you guys later and goodbye. Boom.